Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing A Girl's Fabric Face. This is a $3 game on Steam, created by Stanislaw Trukowski, also known as Turnvex Games. Hopefully I said his name correctly. Uh, he's the same developer behind Continuous, Continuously, Dead Man's Journey, Mind's Eyes, hopefully you've heard of at least one of those. Played all of them on the channel, they're all PT likes, so I'm expecting the same from this one. Let's go ahead and get started. Boom. That was easy. Another turn vex game? Another one? Why did they have to create more than one game? Don't forget to play alone and use headphones. Well, two out of two, quest complete. I am alone and have headphones on. Flashing lights warning, very thoughtful to have. Press M to quit. <laughs> I was about to say, is that the only option I have? Okay, let's go ahead and continue. So I don't know what to expect, except perhaps a uh, girl with a fabric face at some point. Estimated completion time is 30 to 40 minutes. Blee. Space is crouch. That is odd. Hey. Hey. What's up? Come on. Okay. Where are we going? It's time to start again. Yeah. Starting up a new video, never know what we're gonna get. So I'm covering it up right now, but there's a thing in the corner that says paranormal findings, 0%. I'll let you know if it changes. I would just move my face cam, but I don't know if I'm gonna be covering up anything else at the moment. Press E to read. The reporter asked when. I told him, my daughter went off from home on Friday at 8 p.m. June 2nd. That is the last time I saw her. After that, everything just became dark for me. There was no point in living. I've lost my only reason to move on. This looks a lot like the, uh, the house from Timor 5, which is concerning. Getting flashbacks to that thing. Okay. What was that? You want to cook something? There's not even like a, like a grill to put things on different levels. What did I just pick up? Inventory. Set up all my equipment. What am I, your servant? My two cameras and rest area. Oh, you Oh, you want me to set up your rest area? Pure sacrifice will provide considerable fortune for those of the afterlife. Four young and your own will grant such fortune upon the passing. Acceptance of death is needed. Regret, hate, sorrow will bring forth a loop. Oh, so we will have looping hallways. I see. Locked. Darn it. Let's go upstairs. Oh. Place one of the cameras. We just gotta find another camera spot. And we gotta set up their rest area. What, you want me to... I can't reach that. I'm not Shaquille O'Neal, okay? I don't have the height for that. Ooh, somebody took a bite out of that sink. And the, the toilet. Somebody really likes porcelain, what can I say? They got a taste for it. Oh, oh, so we're sleeping here? Just in the hallway? Not in any of the bedrooms or anything? Oh, there's floating dolls here, cool. A recliner in your bedroom? Random letters? No. Probably gotta find a word or something. Oh, there's a key there. Ooh, ooh, I got a key. Doesn't open this one. Okay, there's a, there's a couple locked doors. So, hang on, let me go find another one. I think there's one right here. Yeah, this is not, this was not locked. There's one downstairs. We'll go down there. Kind of reminds me, it looks a little bit like Resident Evil 7, just like the grays and the browns and everything. Boop. We got a safe here. Don't let her out. Is she in the safe? It actually, it actually kind of sounds like she is. I heard some breathing just now, I think. Oh, oh, here we go. Cool. Set up the cameras. What now? All right, we got all your equipment. I should look around the house for a bit to get a feel of the, for the area, make sure nothing is different from the last time I was here. The last time? You, you've come back... 
from last time? What's uh, what's this? A photo piece. Picked it up. Okay, so we're putting together a photo. That's cool. What was that? Did that come from in here? What ha- I'm starting to get a little dizzy. I should rest. Okay. Hey, 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 I wasn't done, alright? Closing the door on me. Boop, go to sleep. Do you believe in ghosts? Sure. Of course you do. Otherwise you wouldn't be here. I mean, I could be a skeptic. Seeking to prove the existence of ghosts or disprove it. Okay, well. What's happening here? Oh, we can, we can, uh, switch between the cameras. Nothing's really happening. I don't really see anything. So, you can record stuff if you want, but... It's storming outside. I don't see anything. Should I have set up more cameras? Can I set up more cameras? I feel like something's gonna happen here. I heard that breathing. There's probably someone here, right? Blip. Well. Well, was that just the entire night? Okay. And now it's daytime, right? There's no windows, of course. Investigate change, if any. Well, I know exactly where I'm gonna go. After I go in here- Ah! This chair is on the side. There's a crowbar. Let's grab that, thanks. Okay, that's good. That's good that I went here first. We got a necessary item. Let's see what... A mid-sized crowbar strong enough to pull some nailed boards. Nailed board. Oh, I know where we go. I know where we go with this. We're gonna look around a little bit more first. Locked. Can't reach that yet. Alright, let's do this. I know where to go. Boop. I don't know why I made the boop sound for me going down the stairs. Not really a boopy kind of sound. Anything change in here? You're not getting let out of there. Quit your whining. Alright. All right, let's go in here, dude. What's in here? Fun stuff? Eating some sewer pickles in here? What's going on? We're gonna overlay that on the letters. It's gonna spell something cool. There's a doll. There's a face. Where's the fabric? Jump scare. No. Just figured it might happen, you know? Okay, so we got a thin piece of metal with random holes cut into them. They are not random, sir. Know exactly where those go. You'll excuse me, I'm on a mission. Hang on, I gotta charge my battery. This is what you gotta do. I've been... I've been trying not to show it on camera. Maybe I'll cut this out, I don't know. Who knows? There we go. Excuse me. Whoa, don't just be throwing that stuff down here. We could use this stepladder to reach the valve. Okay. Oh, I, I was I was crouched the whole time. Awesome. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yep. Keys. Eo. Ooh, Could go. Hmm. He sees you won't go. That's what it says. Oh, he see he see you won't go. Okay. Well, 
We'll see about that. He's never messed with me before. Oh, you know what? I didn't even look in here before. Kind of a crappy room. Eat a grab note. Where was that? At the expense of others, one can truly obtain it all. I don't know where I get, got the word truly from. Oh, because it's said like three times in the next sentence. A true passing, a true death, a true eternity. Nurture the four, then select them off, one by one. Start with the youngest, then proceed onward. Only the devil will hear their suffering, but you all will see it. In the end, only the dead will know your tale. Acceptance is futile. This is the very next page. Very rigid rules. You gotta make sacrifices, you gotta accept. Okay, let's uh... Let's take the valve. Damn it, it's on too tight. What was that? Quit your whining. There has to be something in this house that can loosen this valve up. I mean... Not really, they don't really have anything in this... In this house, in case you haven't noticed. Ooh, there's a teddy bear there. Was that there before? Did I get it? It says behind you, but there's nothing there. I tried to record it. What? Are you making a mess in the kitchen again? No wonder they locked you up in the safe. You are a miscreant. Oh, eat a grab note. What's this? Their face is so red. I covered them with a cloth, but the blood dried. Now the cloth remains. Could this be for the better? Guide me. Who? Oh, I can't get over on this side because the fridge got knocked over. Girl's fabric face? Is that her name? Time to rest. Uh, not just yet. Okay. Girl's fabric face, are you in here? You're in big trouble, young lady. Knocking the fridge over. What have I told you about that? All right, fine, I'll go rest. I'm gonna need some rest to deal with this situation. Bop. Once again, using inappropriate sound effects, that's me. <laughs> I remember when you first came here, 40 years ago, when you were still such a young girl. 16 or 17, if I remember. You'd come by quite often to set up, and stay the night with the spirits. You were very brave. Or very stupid. And in the end, I took you, once I felt the drugs have taken full effect. Edgy deep voice is getting on my nerves a little bit. Oh. I... drugged you. <laughs> What's happening? It lagged there. Did, is there something I missed? Girl's fabric face, where are you? You locked up in that safe? Yeah, that's what I thought. What was that? Is there something there? Yeah, it sure is. I was recording it. Look. It says paranormal findings 0.4%. 2.4% now. Why is the safe open? Something came out of the safe. Oh, that's cool. This game's very different from this developer's previous games. Very impressed so far, to be honest. Investigate what happened while I slept. Oh. Are you sure you want to do that? My paranormal findings is very low. 
Not what it seems. Okay, so it's, it's got a new message for us every day. It's not what it seems. It seems like somebody was locked up in the safe and then they got out somehow. And they probably don't mean me... You know, what's the opposite of harm? Meaning me harm. They don't mean me, uh... Oh. There's a children's drawing of, uh... A guy being hung on a tree. That doesn't seem like a threat or anything. Yeah, it's not what it seems, sure. Can I get that, uh, valve anytime soon? Okay, fine. I'm coming down. Yeah, I know the battery's low. Hang on, guys. Gotta charge the battery. Alright, here we go. Ha! Ha! Oh. Got a bolt cutter. And a dolly. Bolt cutter. Maybe to to loosen the stuff for the valve? Are we getting the valve? Yeah, you're not a girl's fabric face. I know a girl's fabric face when I see it, okay? I'm very good friends with a girl's fabric face. What was that? Oh, that was the camera. Okay. I got Why don't you take the valve? Come on. Darn it. It's on too tight. Well, what is the bolt cutter for? Cable of cutting thick chains with the- Oh, okay. Say no more. Got it. Hang on. Okay. What? 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 Guys, I think this is the same house from Two More Five somehow. Except this is how you do it, to be honest. What? What's going on down here? What's going on down here, huh? Let's read this note. Poem number three, dangling there with importance to her side. Once lost, all is lost. Use what is found to unlock new meaning. Poem number four, a picture of oneself, viewed by oneself, dead, placed in the room of capture will alter all perception. A view of your body, lifeless, has a power that is priceless. What a poem. We got the next Robert Frost over here. Maybe a power box. Ah. Locked. You were there before, right? Yeah, of course you were. Plumber's wrench. When? Day. Oh, 40 years, right? What even is the... Do we have any dates? I don't think we do. 40 years back. Okay, so we got the day, and then we got the house crying blood, and the time, and the month. Looks like it's on the second day, perhaps. Okay, we need more information, I guess. Oh, okay, we got the plumber's wrench. Let me see what it says. A plumber- okay, thanks. That's very enlightening. That helps a lot. In one ring. What was that? What was that? Fans going haywire. What was that? Okay, we got the wrench for the valve, I assume. It sounds like rope in there. Thank you. That's a large wrench. 
A large valve. I believe I remember seeing this fit somewhere. But you do? Here? What was that? I heard, like, metal on metal just now. What? Picked up a key. Another key, but with a very complex pattern, it must be for an important room. Okay, hang on, hang on. There's two locked rooms I know of. But, uh, wait, no, this isn't locked. This is just... This is the other side of the basement, right? Girl's fabric face, is that you? What's locked? Okay, hang on, there's a... Uh, maybe 60? Is that scary enough? 60? What does that mean? Uh, let's see. Diary, someone has willfully, oh, will, willingly come, young and beautiful, appears to be recording a video. I placed a pill in her water. She should suffer hallucination and weakness. Her name is Anna. She is very warm. You are very creepy. Okay, well. Oh, come on. What? I think it's time to get the hell out of here. This is far too much. We don't want to... Why don't I hear it, the rope anymore? Oh! <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what? It locked us in here. Am I hallucinating? I need to find an exit. Okay, well, I'll look for one. Hang on, hang on. Red, red means scary, etc. Through the fireplace. I don't think there is an exit, dude. The mo like, the, the closest I can think of is down here. Wait, hang on. This is the closest I can think of, and it's locked. So... Power box. Where are you, Anna? Why do you keep running from me? What? Because you're creepy and crazy? That, that could be why. Oh boy, okay. I remember how you looked. Lulus. And plain as your mind was filling more and more with hallucinations. To the point where you became numb. You probably don't remember how you died. The others don't know too since you were the final doll to perish. When's this thing gonna do something? Oh. I'm at 4.7% for paranormal findings. It's very low. Come on, move again. Okay, 10.4%. I can't switch back to camera one. I can't switch back. 
14.8%. I just have to say it because... Okay, I can just do this. I can just do this. It's inelegant, but it works. I figured out how to do it at the very, very last second. Okay, 15.1. It was a twisted game. All four of you died. But I did place a doll by your passing body to never forget you. Any of you. Oh, that's why there were four dolls up here. Let's see what the secret message says. It's your turn now. What? My turn? Keep- let me out. Okay, well, let's, uh, get out of here, shall we? Um, does this lead out? Hell's Loop. Or Deception, maybe. Uh... Unfortunately, it didn't quite go to plan. Anna, your hate towards me, your desire to see me fail is causing all of this. This, this right here, it's a hell's loop. A loop for our final moments together. And it doesn't matter if you died. We're all to start over, and over, and over. <laughs> Your resistance is what's causing this loop. Why can't you accept that I'm doing this for all of you? For all of you to know a perfect eternity. This is not just for me, but for you too, Anna. We can pass on together. Just you and I. And have a perfect end. That sounds awful. Up. Down left. Um, oh, what is the same thing? Where am I going? What? Come on out here, Edge Lord. What are you doing? <laughs> I took the doll. What am I doing with it now? Am I putting it on this hook? Ah, it's open. Think of what I've been through. The things I've seen and done before I took my own life. I've been through it so many times and I've felt it so many times. Don't you want it to end too? Haven't you had enough? <laughs> Why don't you think about the rest of us and in this damn loop? I understand I'm the one that killed you, and all the others, but that was over 40 years ago. It's time to forgive, and to move on. Okay, well... You sound like a real piece of work. I don't want to forgive you, so... <laughs> am, I, am I taking all these dolls, or...? What am I supposed to do? Okay, what is this? I I for some reason I've I've skipped out on all the photo pieces. Um This is locked still. That opened up though. I don't know. Oh. Press one to forgive, press two to not forgive. Not forgive! I hope you know what you're doing. I don't. Cool. 
All right, bye. Why I'm back in? Oh no, no, the fridge is over here. Um, well, I can't go back upstairs. Do I have to go into the basement? Okay. Here we go. I didn't forgive you, and now I don't know. What do I sleep here now? <laughs> Stuck on the loop forever. Ooh. Oh, this is my... These are my notes. It's all bloody. Ooh, there's hooks. Hey. Hey. What's up? June 22nd, 1968. Four girls and a man were found dead in an old abandoned home located in Saddlewin. The four girls in the age group between 2 and 16 were found dead, scattered throughout the house with fabric covering their wounded bodies, stuck with horrific amounts of blood. All girls are believed to have died from severe blood loss, while the man has died from suicide from gun to head, from being changed to, uh, chained to a cold crawl space, locked in a vault, hung from the ceiling with a hook, and cut to death in a cradle. The scene was the most brutal the town has ever seen. To this, we announced this murder as the girls with the fabric face. Don't think it's true, but I'll... I'll look it up just in case. Sounds like it was made just for the game. Hey. Hey. Come on. What, are we doing it again? It's time to start again. Oh, or we could just not. We could just not. Okay, achieved ending one of four. A stubborn ending. Bad ending. It's the bad ending. Well, fine. Then I got the bad ending. One of four. Okay, so I guess ending two would be if you forgive. There were a couple, there was a safe that I could have opened. June 22nd, 1968. Hmm. Okay, um, I thought I knew how to get the safe open, which I think is one of the keys to getting one of the other endings, but alas, I do not quite have all the information yet. I have gotten my paranormal findings up, because I knew when to record this time. Um, I'm just going to end the video here. I might try to get more of the endings, but... I think we'll just leave it here for now. I want to get my thoughts on this game. I think that it's the best game by this developer by far. Uh, once again, I've played four of the other games, maybe five. I'm not sure. It all kind of blurs together. At least four, though. Uh, and this is by far the best one. Um, I think it's a pretty decent game, especially for $3. Uh, I don't think it's outstanding, but I think it's very good. Um, especially for the price. It's got some cool moments in it, some unique aspects, some replayability, actually. Quite a bit of replayability. It seems like, um... The way that you achieve the first two endings is about the same, but the way you achieve the other two endings requires some more in-depth um, investigation. For example, uh, this poem number four here says, A picture of oneself viewed by oneself placed in the room of capture will alter all perception. So basically what this is saying, I think, is that you need to find all the photo pieces and then view your dead body, which I think is maybe the one that's being hung in that one room. And perhaps that's how you unlock one of the other endings. But I've, I've been doing a very poor job of finding the photos. Anyway, so yeah, I, I enjoyed this actually. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments. And if you really want, I'll come back to it and try to get more endings. But yeah, my, my battery's getting low, so I better go. But yeah, I, I enjoyed it. It was it was not not bad. Don't have a whole lot to say. I did. I liked that it wasn't overly reliant on jump scares. It had creepy moments in it. It provided a uh, subtle and unique atmosphere. I'm a little frustrated with this developer for wasting so much time making PT likes when he had this in his back pocket. Because <laughs> this is way better. Uh, yeah, so that's what I think of a girl's fabric face. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Think critically.